Hi, Draw So Cuties, Winnie here. Today we're going to draw a school, so let's get started. To draw this awesome school, let's first start by drawing the roof. So I'm just going to start right here because it's easier for my hand, and I'm going to go up and angle. So this is the pitch of our roof, and then I'm going to go up right here. I'm just going to thicken this up just a little bit easier, just get this side done with. So about that thick, and then I'm going to go ahead and just follow my bottom angle and I'll bring it all the way back up right there. Then from there I'm going to start to bring this down so kind of at the same angle so just turn your body whatever you need to do to try your best to get the same angle. So I'll just bring a point across since I'm drawing a little bit bigger so say about right there. So just a little bit more even and I'll just go down to my point and then now I can go ahead and just follow my bottom. So just play around with it. You can start from the center to draw this roof, whatever is easiest. So the more right there, I'm just going to bring a straight line down. Now that I have my pitch right there, I'm going to bring the sides of our building in. So just going to come in a little bit and just draw a straight line down on both sides. Then from there, I'm going to draw in some details to figure out how tall I want this building to be. So right in the center, the most important thing in a school, <laughs> I think, is the clock, right? So you know that you're on time, more time to get out of school, right? So I'm going to draw a big circle right here, right in the center. And then let's come to the center of this circle. I'm just going to add a dot and I'll add two arrows. So one going this way and then maybe another one going this way. There. So we know it's a clock for sure. And then right underneath this clock, I'm just going to come about right here. I'm just going to go ahead and draw a rectangle right in the center. So this would be like where you would put the name of your school or however you, whatever you want to put. So about right there. I'm just going to draw this little rectangle. And right underneath this rectangle is where the doors are going to be. So I'm going to come, let's say about right here, right underneath. So everything is nice and centered to this point right here. Okay, so I have my wobbly line and I'm going to bring this down and bring this down. So we want some nice big doors, right? Double doors. So I'll bring this down a little bit more. say about that wide and I'm going to find the center about right here and draw a center line right there to divide our door and then right here I'm going to come out with another line to end it. So this line is going to be the beginning of our stairs. So I'm going to come down with another rectangle and this bottom line is going to be coming out a little bit wider and another one. So these are the stairs. So you just want, if you want more stairs, just keep going wider and wider. There. So now that I have the door and the stairs and I know I'm going to bring my building down to about this point on my stair. So find the center of your stairs and about right there is where I'm going to bring down the building. So let's just bring this down to about right there and connect. And same thing here. So if you want everything perfectly straight, you can always just go back with a ruler. And now we have our building. So let's come in here and add some details. So let's see here. First of all, let's draw some windows in our door. So I'm just going to go ahead and draw a rectangle on both of these doors. So this is just a very general, I mean hospital, <laughs> general school that I'm drawing here. So I just really hope this inspires you and that I'm making it fun and easy for you to follow along. And it inspires you to draw your own school. So right here, we're going to put in some handles. So I'll just make two little rectangles or you can make circles, up to you. And let's see here, let's add some windows here as well. So come around over here. And we're going to add some long windows. So lots of straight lines today. I'm going to go in the center. 
and two more lines right here. There. I'll just make these two center lines a little bit thicker just to add definition to our windows. So same thing over here. So let's say about right here, just like the other side, we're gonna go right across and bring it down to about right here. So definitely let me know in the comments below if you love this drawing, if it looks like your school, or if you love your school, give your school a shout out in the comments. I think that would be really fun, right? So right here, just gonna take two more lines, nice and light. Okay, so now that we have that in, let's go ahead and let's make this school a little bit bigger. So I'm gonna come out to the sides right here just to make it simpler. I'm just gonna about right here. Draw another straight line across, give it a little pitch for a roof. Come in and then I'm gonna bring a straight line down up there I just end it a little bit higher than this side right here just a little bit so it's kind of see it's in the for uh, background a little bit so all right there once again same thing go across whatever is easiest so about right there draw my little pitch and then bring it down and once again, we're gonna end up just a tiny bit higher. From there, let's add more details right here. So I'm just gonna go ahead and add uh, two windows to simplify it. So one up here and maybe a taller one down here. And let's add the center lines. Maybe we just add one line here and then one that goes like this, just to change it up. So this one just has one line. Okay, so same exact thing over here as well. So about right here, just kind of looking at the other side, make sure I'm about the same on both sides. And one more. So of course, after you draw your school, you can add whatever you want, right? You can add a bus, you can add people, animals, whatever you like. Okay, so now that I have that, um, let's go ahead and add a flag to this uh, school. So I'm gonna put it right on top just to make it a little bit easier to draw. You can even add one of those little towers up here and put a bell in if you like the you know, older school but right here I'm just gonna add this little bar with a little circle and then I'm gonna bring out a flag right here and what should we put here I'll just put a bunch of hearts whatever I can fit <laughs> okay one more there three hearts and then let's see what else. Oh, we should write the word. I'm just going to write the word school. But like I said, you can write the name of your school here. S H O. I better write it really big, right? C. I have a lot of room. H O O L. Okay, so I've, hopefully I spelled that right, I think I did. And then let's see, let's decorate our school. Let's add some greenery. So in the front right here, I'm just gonna add some bushes, whatever you like. And let's add some here as well. And just end it, same thing here. Let's add some trees, of course. So I'm gonna come right in this area. Add some very simple branches and then we're just gonna go up. Some trees, maybe another one right in the back. Nice and big. 
Because if I went to a school, I would love to have it, have so many trees. That would be so awesome. Okay, and then let's do the same thing over here as well. So once again. just to finish it up and if you like you can even let's just put a sign here just for fun a little sign pointing to the school because school is this way <laughs> there and you can write school s-e-h-o-o-l there i made it and you can even when you're coloring, you can add some clouds or whatever you like. And that is pretty much it for this uh, school that I hope I made fun and easy for you to follow along with me. Thanks so much for watching. And if you loved it and I helped you out today, please make sure to give me a like and subscribe so you won't miss any new Draw So Cute videos. See you later.